Hello MBBs, welcome on my channel and page and BB Ruth. So today I have a special ingredient that we are going to use in my deep conditioner. You know I love to try new things. Sorry for my voice, but this is what we have to deal with today. And welcome to all the new viewers. My name is Ruth and if you like this video and the content and you love doing uh, your own natural hair products and skin products, then why don't you follow me? So let's dive straight into the video. So I received this basket full of artichokes. Now I'm, I am not very used to these vegetables because I don't even like the scent so I don't eat it. But when I received this basket I was like there must be it should have some benefits for my skin and for my hair that I can use topically. And lo and behold these are the findings that I discovered. Now artichokes are a perfect shield to the cuticles in the hair shafts because they leave um, the hair surface flat and smooth giving shine, sleek and freeze free. And this happens because it has high level of antioxidants with which also protects our hair against UV exposure. It's also very good for those who have hair that are colored. If you go to the swimming pool, if you go to the beach side, it protects the hair from all these agents. It gives shields because it, it and it also deeply cleans the hair uh, because it has the property to remove minerals deposit on the hair, which can cause dullness. When I discover all this, I was like, I must try it. I'm must use it despite I don't like the taste so I started with the first artichokes I just clean it wash it very well then I read that um, the the edges of the articles are not needed so this first time I cut it all off so for this first time I want to use it uh, alone uh, mixing it only with katira and see how my hair is going to react you know i love to try things gradually step by step just to see how my hair reacts uh, while mixing it with different ingredients so I can, you, as you can see from the video, I wasn't very confident of the way I was cutting. Because when I was cutting, I was like, what's wrong with the edges? Can't I just leave them? Then I also read that to produce a decoction, because this is the first, the first step, to produce a decoction, I have to remove the heart of the artichoke. Now, this was my first time seeing an artichoke from the inside. So I was like, what is this? this it looks like a wool or something like that and i was very intrigued like wow i never knew articles artichoke was like this from the inside so from the first time i did follow the instructions and i removed everything i'm going to have other parts uh, videos using the artichokes in different ways uh, during my wash day so the other times i just went ahead and boiled everything together i didn't remove anything nothing upon nothing so as i was removing everything i was like wow this is difficult so this the second part i just cut it into two and removed the hearts and that made made the removal definitely um, far far easier um, so I have to confess that um, it also has very good properties for the scalp and the hair also when you eat it so if you are a lover of articles just go ahead because it's good for the general health but it's also good especially for the hair and the scalp so to create my decoction I have hot water which was still on fire and I dropped the article the artichokes I find it even difficult to pronounce it and I dipped the artichokes in the pot and I let it boil for like five minutes. And then after the five minutes of boiling, I off the uh, fire and let it sit for about 12 hours. Let me say um, for the, no, no, no. This first time I let it sit for about six hours. Yes, not the whole day, just six hours. And this gives the chance to the um, artichokes to release all of its um, benefits 
goodies ingredients in the water you can see how the color of the water has changed and this means something is definitely happening so after letting it sit for about six hours you can see how intense um the color has become and uh, this tells me that uh, we are doing a good job the decoction is ready to be used and i'm really very excited to see how my hair is going to uh, respond in time in, in the course of the time uh, to this uh, treatment um so the next step is to see the liquid because we are just going to use the liquid um, I was surprised to see to notice that the artichoke didn't become uh, soft okay I thought after boiling for some time and sitting in the water it was going to become soft but it didn't um, so I just throw that away the liquid I got in total was um, um, about uh, 363 grams and I'm going to pour about um, to drop about 20 grams of Katira Gond in it for those of you who have been following me you know how much I love Katira Gond it gives strength and volume to the hair it also it also deeply conditions the hair and it and it's a great remedy in case you have brittle hair dry hair wicking hair or dual hair i've been using it for every blessed thing and i can i can assure you it's great after you drop your sap in uh, it needs you let it sit till the next day and this is how it turns it becomes very grainy that's because the gond katira have swollen up and it has absorbed the water the liquid that you drop it that you drop it in um the more you leave it the more it's going to absorb the liquid and this will make the use very very simple on your hair and also on your skin yes i also use it on my skin there is another video where i show how i mix it with uh kuku kukuma sorry it wasn't coming and i'm really loving it for my skin it gives me really very nice shine so now i'm going to add my favorite um, essential oils uh, they give it a good smell but they also helps to treat uh, the scalp so i add few drops of uh, peppermint essential oils a uh, few drops of tea tree essential oils and also few drops of uh, rosemary essential oils you can use your favorite ones the ones you love you know that your hair and scalp um, love so after adding all of these um, ingredients for this first day I only want to use the arch artichoke as natural as possible um, because with time I'll be mixing it then you blend um, the uh, mixture and it will turn into a very soft gel that you can easily apply on your hair and on your skin of a truth I really don't know why I don't see a lot of naturals using gaunt katira for their natural hair recipe because girls is really great it also makes um, the use of those ingredients that are healthy for the hair but they can leave your hair dry like henna like cassia like amla it can uh, like green tea um, because of the deep conditioning it has it can help to make the use of those ingredients easier on your hair you'll get the benefits without getting the dryness so this is how it turns when you blend it very well it turns into this beautiful gel that it's uh, it's very easy to use on the skin and on the hair i normally like to get every bit of the conditioner or the leave-in conditioner the deep conditioner i'm using i really like to get every um gram of it from the utensils that i normally uh, use and we get almost 400 grams of deep conditioner so i'm going to use it on my hair um that is um, washed uh, that day i did a clay mask using rasu clay and green clay so my hair had absolutely no moisture uh no um yeah no moisture because i didn't pre-poo normally on days like this um uh, it takes time for my hair to really get the um that uh 
softness that I normally get um, on the days I normally pre pull. So the deep conditioner, I'm applying it on my hair section by section. I love to work on my hair section by section. It makes the application easier and also more efficient. Check out how uh, my hair change after applying my deep conditioner. Uh, the curls are popping and uh, this is a good sign. Even though artichokes doesn't have uh, great conditioner conditioning properties, uh, remember there is also Katira in there, so it's going to play its little uh, part. So then I quickly proceed and apply the uh, deep conditioner all over my hair, making sure to cover every uh, centimeters. I also apply it on the scalp because it also has uh, good properties on the scalp so as usual after preparing my after covering all my hair i'm going to steam my hair to steam the hair means to apply heat for a certain amount of time so that your hair cuticles will open and they will be able to your hair will be able to absorb all the nutrients of your of the products that you just applied um with time i have used different procedures and the one i love right now is my heating bonnet i just put it in the microwave here it is i got it on amazon i just put it on the microwave and i'm good to go it will stay warm for about 25 to 30 minutes and during that period my hands are free i can i can just do other activities i can rewarm it and uh, i can go for one one hour um, even more than that with uh, my head feeling very very uh, warm so after steaming my hair for about 25 minutes I rinse it out with only water and this is my hair after rinsing it out so what is my feedback after this first use well definitely the moisture that I get on my hair was from from the Katira Gond that I used on my hair I have seen an increment of shine on my hair especially when I was up right from when I was applying the deep conditioner on the first section and um, the overall moisture is not comparable to when I use uh, Moringa as well or hibiscus on my hair. This artichoke is one of those ingredients that needs time to be used on the hair and see how it uh, how the hair uh, responds to it after some months so i would definitely keep using it and experimenting with it what i expect to see more since it flattened uh, the hair cuticles is to see less um, knots fairy knots on my ends in the course of time as i've even taken it as a mission to take care of my ends in a better way this year so this is my feedback and this is part one you are definitely going to see part two and part three and part four of this uh, artichoke series deep conditioners and we will see how my hair will respond to it in the course of time thank you very much for watching if you like this video make sure you put thumbs up or you like it and you also follow me i have tons of other videos that you can watch thank you very much once again have a beautiful day Mwah.